Get them, spin them, but lunch in my shoe and the denim. I put the rockets on them. Big bands can't bend them. What's up, Tifas? What's up, Tifas? So your girl is back with another video. Oh my God, you guys, I was about to do this video for a whole different company. Thank God I write the name on the lace because had I did that and went all the way through, I would have been peed off. You know, they start looking alike after a while, but then you can tell the quality and I really just was like, oh my God. First of all, what's up you guys? Thank you for stopping back to my channel. It's your girl, April. I've worked with this company probably like eight, nine times by now. Do have a website and they also have a store on Amazon, Be Show Hair. They have like some really good quality wigs. On their actual website, you will find more to choose from. They also will have coupon codes. Check them out on Amazon where you can also use your prime and get your stuff on time. Like I tell you guys, Be Show Hair has a lot of affordable lace front wigs, glueless full lace wigs, whatever you're looking for, you can definitely check them out. So before we get into this video, I'm going to show you guys how your items will come. When you receive your package from Be Show Hair, you receive it in their standard black box. This will also come from Amazon as well, the standard black packaging. Regardless if you purchase online or on Amazon.com, all of the packaging will be the same. You also receive one of their standard cards. Along with that, a two-piece wig cap, which will keep your hair protective against the wig. The unit that I received is their 13 by 6, 20 inch body wave lace front. This unit does come in 10 to 24 inches and is available in 150% density. The color of the lace is a light brown. There are four combs inside the unit, along with that, an adjustable strap and a black elastic band that has also been sewn. As you guys will notice, you will need to bleach the knots in the unit if you prefer a more natural scalp-like appearance. I prefer to use a 30 volume developer along with bleach. V Show Hair has many different quality wigs available on their website along with that Amazon Prime. check out V-Show on Amazon along with that their website. I'll link all the information below. So the unit that I have here is a 13 by 6 20 inch body wave lace front. I think it's either Brazilian or Malaysian. There was an elastic band already sewn in the unit for me which makes it a whole lot easier and the lace is transparent lace. I did use the wig extensions tinting spray and the color that I used is the beige color. There are the combs in the unit right here. Anchor comb, the elastic band, the adjustable straps, and the comb in the name. I also went ahead and bleached the unit as I normally do. And I also pre-plucked it and styled it off camera. Let me tell y'all. Let me tell y'all something. Okay, let me tell you something, girl. Some of these companies be having 20 inches, and their 20 inches be looking like 22, 24. Hopefully, it turns out great. So, let's get into this unit. Be show hair. I'm going to listen to some music, and yeah, we're going to get into it. All right, guys, let's get started into this wig. First thing I'm going to do is take out these clips. Now, this is their body wave. It's 20 inches, 150% density, 13 by 6, Okay. First of all, I did say that it was transparent. Girl, I lied. I had to go back and look at the email and click on the link, which is available for only $143 on Amazon. And this is just a light brown lace color. So this is not transparent. I do apologize if I did 
mention that in the video. It does come with natural baby hairs in the front, along with that in the perimeter of the wig. I like V-Show. They have a lot of affordable wigs. Y'all know I love me some Amazon, okay? So, I mean, hey, listen. If you can get a good wig for quality and, like, cheap, girl, check them out. Now, I've worked with them numerous times, and this one right here, I went ahead and sprayed my tinting spray on it. Now, the one that I used was by the brand called Wig Extensions, and I used the tinting spray in the color Golden, which I don't really think worked out in my favor. It kind of looks like on camera, it's giving it kind of like a yellowish tinting color. So please excuse that. This is definitely not the lace. This is the tinting spray. After a few washes, the tinting spray will definitely um, come off. So if you do have a tinting spray and you don't like the color, just know that it will not be a permanent spray. It will definitely wash off after a few washes. I would say use some purple shampoo on it, on the lace to remove it if you don't like the color. But for me, I really wasn't feeling the color of the tinting spray after I seen it. But I did build the color up. So maybe it had I not sprayed probably like seven times, the color wouldn't have been so, you know, dark. But you can definitely lessen the color by just a few less pumps of spray. But anyway, you know, that's just a trial and error. But as far as V-Show, like I said, I've worked with them numerous times. I like their wigs. I think they're really good beginner wigs. I think they're really good quality, affordable, budget-friendly wigs. Even if you like to spend a lot of money on wigs, it doesn't hurt to have a good few quality wigs that are underpriced. You know, and I really feel like their prices are very affordable, especially for a 20-inch. $143, you cannot beat that. Even on their website, their wigs are affordable. They have loads of coupon codes or loads of coupons on their website too. So you can definitely save some money. And I know that this time, during this time, you know, we are all going through, you know, the lockdown period. So don't force yourself to feel like you have to buy anything, but just watch the video just to have some fun and get away from the craziness that's going on in the world. So that's the reason why I'm just, you know, uploading the video because I'm trying to keep my mind free of what's going on in the world right now you know i don't want to watch too much of the news or social media because at times it could be a little bit overwhelming so i try to enjoy myself by editing videos recording videos talking to you guys whatever just try to manage your stress levels and try not to watch too much of the news and social media because it can work a lot on your nerves and definitely on anxiety so you know i just want to put that out there to you guys you know, don't feel like you have to force yourself to purchase anything, you know, but just take time for yourselves. Try to enjoy other things in life as well. Get to know yourself, get to know your family, you know, tweak them wig skills, okay? Listen, I'm about to push out some makeup videos. I am not a makeup person. I mean, I'm not a makeup pro. I'm not a makeup artist. I do what I can, but I feel like, you know what? We have to take time. We have to entertain ourselves. So I feel like, hey, let me tweak some of the things that I'm not that great in. You know, let me practice my skills up a little bit, you know. So if y'all see me come on some videos with some crazy looking eyeshadow or whatever in the near future videos, just know that a girl was practicing, okay? So I'm going to put out some videos of makeup. Like I said, I'm not a makeup artist, but I just want to have fun with you guys and, you know, push out some videos to give you guys some content to watch versus, you know, drowning yourselves in sorrows and what's going on. You know, I love you guys and I'm just very concerned about your well-being, all you guys is, because I know my well-being has been a little bit stressed because of all of this going on. You know, I really don't like to talk about it as much, but it is reality. But I will say, you know, I have bad anxiety and um, this is really not good for me to watch this type of social media news all the time. It has really heighten my anxiety. So I try to steer clear of it as much as I can, but also to keep abreast and, you know, know what's going on too. But I do have to step away from, you know, social media a lot and the news quite frequently, just so that way I can keep my sanity. So I just want you all to keep your sanity as well. And I know you guys have seen me do videos over and over and over again. So I really don't need to explain much, but listen, enjoy yourselves, get to know your family, get to know yourselves. Find some new hobbies. Pick up some new skills. Try something out that you haven't tried out. Try some blue eyeshadow out. Hey, try hairspraying a wig down. Even if you got some cheap hairspray, try it out. You know, it doesn't hurt to try. Just relieve your mind of this everyday stress that we are all going through right now. And just remember to be kind to everybody. You know, try to be kind. Don't get too close to people, but just try to 
be kind to everyone because we are all in this. Everybody is going through this. We are not alone. So I didn't really care for the middle part. You know, I'm not really a middle part girl, you guys. You already know that. And I wasn't too happy that the curls did not stay, but I really wasn't happy that it was a middle part. So, of course, you know, I'm going to just go ahead and quickly finish the parting. I'm going to redo it. You know your girl will redo something in a minute. And I'm definitely going to do it off camera because I don't really want to bore y'all too much with me hot pressing that area. You know, it is what it is. Okay. But definitely you want to check out Visho Hair. You can check them out. In the meantime, read the reviews. Look on YouTube at other reviews for Amazon's um, Visho Hair vendor. They have some really good quality wigs. I wouldn't even lie. So, you know, this is the final outcome, girl. I'm thinking she looks really cute. You know, something sleek and just normal. Average basic look. All right, you guys. So this is finally the finished outcome. Let me tell you, I am so, well, I'm not really upset, but I'll be, you know, I spend my time curling the hair and then for it to come, all the curls to drop out of it. That was kind of not the whole point of styling the hair off camera. And because it was just kind of crazy looking, I just decided to put it on a part on the right side because I just thought it looked a lot better. You guys know I'm not really a middle person part, but for the most part, the wig is very low luster. It is shedding a little bit. I'm not sure if it's because of the hairs that I plucked or cut off, but it does have a little bit of shedding. It doesn't have like that very shiny, shiny look. The more natural, the better for me. So I kind of like like a medium luster, medium sheen. You know, you can always sheen it up yourself if you want to. You know, as far as the tinting spray, I'm not really sure how I'm feeling about the color because I do notice sometimes like it will run if you add your hairspray or your product to it. But this has actually been sitting in the wig for like over a week and a half. So it actually cured in the wig and it did not run. So if you are using like a liquid tinting spray, I would highly advise to let you, I would highly advise you guys to let it sit in the wig for a couple of days before you even decide to apply it with any type of wet product. Because if you don't, it will run immediately after applying it. So just give it like at least 24 hours. These wigs really start looking like they are 22 inches. Like I remember back in the days, 20 inches was like right here, girl. This is the new 20 inches. 20 inches is really 22. So I guess 22 is like almost 24. Either way, it's really inexpensive. I do believe the density is 150. So I'll leave all of the information down below. You can check out their actual website. You can also check them out on Amazon because you know what I say. If you got Amazon Prime, you get your on time, girl. Okay? So on that note, I love you guys. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs this video up, share it with everybody in the world. You know how we do. I love you, and I will see you on the next video. Get them, spin them, but lunch in my shoe and the denim. I put the rockets on them. Big mans can't bend them. Ops, we hit them. Fuck them off, we bend them.